Hi everyone. In today class we are going to see how the PLC will help for automatic coffee making machine. In this uh, machine we can get a cup of coffee by inserting a coin in the machine. In this example we used valves for controlling the coffee outlet and the hot water outlet. Agitator is used to for mixing purpose in the container. Here, coffee outlet will start its function when the coin is inserted. Here we are using you know, two detectors. One is coin detector and then another one is a you know, pressure detector. The coin detector is used to detect the coin and then pressure detector is used to indicate the pressure which will be helpful for you know, uh, opening the co ready made coffee outlet. When the coin is inserted, coffee outlet and the cup outlet will start and turn off after some time period. After that, hot water outlet will start. Hot water outlet will be poured in the container. Then uh, agitator will start its function. And after mixing, ready made coffee will be poured into the empty cup. So the total input and output list here are the, here we having you know four input list that is a start push button, stop push button, coin detector and then pressure detector. These are all the inputs to the PLC. And then total output list from the PLCs are paper cup outlet that is Q 0 0.1 and then coffee outlet that is Q 0 0.2 and then hot water outlet Q 0 0.3 and then mixed container outlet Q 0 0.4 and that is an agitator function Q0.5 is a ready made coffee outlet and here we are using an only one memory unit. Now we are going to see the ladder logic for this application. In the this ladder logic is divided into you know, an 8 network for an uh, understanding purpose. In the network 1 this rung line on, consists of you know, stop under on push button to switch on the and off the machine. In the network 2 uh, when the system when the system is uh, on and when coin is uh, detected paper cup outlet that is Q0.1 and the coffee outlet uh, will be on. In the network uh, 3 when the both outputs that is a uh, uh, paper cup outlet and coffee outlet are on uh, the timer will need to be start on right so the timer uh, uh, here is connected in the rung line 3 so after the here uh, we set the timer for an uh, 10 second so the after the time period of an uh, 10 second the hot water when the timer uh, here the timer is set as an uh, 10 second after the 10 second period of time thus both paper cup outlet and a uh, coffee outlet uh, will get off and the hot water outlet will start on. So in the network 4 hot, let out, hot water outlet will start after the time period of 10 seconds and the both uh, paper cup outlet and the coffee outlet will stop after the hot water will start on. In the network uh, yeah. agitated in the network 5, if the pressure is detected, agitator and ready made coffee on delay timer will be start on. So, and then in the network 6, after given a delay, ready made coffee outlet will be, will, will be on. In the network 7, when the pressure is not detected, ready made coffee outlet will be off. So, in the network 8, when the system is off, or the emergency button is uh, pressed down, all the outputs should be reset. So that is uh, uh, that ladder logic is uh, given in the network uh, 8. So this is uh, now uh, only idea about the uh, about this application. We can extend this ladder logic for a uh, high level of an application. Thank you. Thank you for listening.